Known as virtual reality, or VR, this new technology uses pictures and sounds to wrap around your senses. Imagine a place, and you'll be able to step into it. Conjure up a dream, and you'll be able to fly through it. It's unreal. It's different. And it's so natural that when you experience it, it's something that uh, you know, people come out of the system and say, wow, that's unreal. For those of us not all up in the latest technology, virtual reality is something like a video game, only it's three-dimensional. It makes you feel as if you are part of what you're looking at. It's been used to train pilots, it's been used to entertain. We've put it on the agenda because it may have another very important application. To enter this illusory computer graphic world, people wear special glasses which incorporate a liquid crystal television screen and they wear gloves called data gloves. We've got two small color TV flat screen in here, one for each eye, and the optics that make the image look like it's further away. So this is an electronic 3D image that we're going to project. You've got okay. it. Virtual reality, however, has left the lab and is coming to our neighborhoods. Right now, for example, virtual reality theaters are being planned all over the world. And this fall, Sega plans to market the first affordable VR helmet for home use. Virtual Boy, see it now in 